Debugging web applications running on iOS devices is super easy, whether they are running in Chrome, in Edge, or even in Safari. Let's see how we can do it. Apart from your iOS device, the only prerequisite you need is to have a macOS device as well, because all the browsers on iOS are using WebKit for rendering, and that means that you have to be debugging your web applications using Safari on macOS. Now let's switch to iOS. Each browser on iOS requires a separate setup to allow the web inspector to actually debug web applications. For Chrome, you can go to the three dots button, then settings, and inside settings, you search for content settings. And in there, there is web inspector, which you can just toggle on. For Microsoft Edge, it's very similar. You go to settings, then you scroll down, site settings, and in there, you allow Web Inspector. And finally, for Safari, because it's a system application, you go directly into the system settings, and inside of there, you search for Safari, and in there, on the Safari page, you scroll all the way down to the bottom to find the advanced options. And inside of the advanced options, you will find Web Inspector. Again, you toggle it on to allow debugging. Now we're ready to start debugging. On macOS, open Safari, and then go to the Develop menu, and then select your iOS device. The good thing is that when you highlight one of those open pages on your iOS device, you will see it flicker, kind of showing you which specific page are you going to debug when you click it. So when you select a specific page, you will be shown the Web Inspector window, where you have all those familiar Web Inspector settings. So you can uh, select, highlight specific parts of your website. You can also change the DOM, so you can adjust various parts of your DOM tree. And you can then also go to the Networking tab or edit sources and so on. So it's a very powerful way to debug web application as they are running on a real iOS device. If you like this video, subscribe and see you next time.